and y'all this is Darrell D West Enterprise. Got a nice one for y'all today. Let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so we got this dining room here. Now the crazy thing is is when they called, I asked, like I usually do. How bad is the carpet on a scale of one to five? And their reply was not that bad. It's just me, my husband, and mother or so, I forget. But they said it was just three people. And you can see what we got going on here. So we got uh, the carpet to do. I got the house cleaners cleaning the, uh, the uh, kitchen, bathrooms and windows and I'm doing the carpet this tile here definitely filthy but you know once they start trying to negotiate price I don't even try to bring up stuff but yeah I pretty much stand firm on my prices for the most part so this would be the living room I already vacuumed but just wanted to show you guys this. I wasn't going to take any video, but this is something good to show you guys. Got the cleaners in here. They're doing the, uh, I mean, the walls need to be painted and stuff. Uh, so I doubt they're looking for perfection, but, you know, we try our best. So we'll be uh, taking care of all this. this room here to do so and then this room over here and then they're cleaning these bathrooms and then there's another bathroom in that room over there so yeah let's get to it all right so they added on this refrigerator and freezer last moment so I said I'll just tackle it real quick see what we got usually I just spray it down let it sit for a minute come back to it it's already been uh, I probably want that removed it's already been uh, unplugged so And it's just a, a all-purpose cleaner I like to use. I'll take this stuff out like so. Maybe put the bubble wrap in here. Keep the uh, food safe from any uh, <laughs> from any accidents that may occur. So. I mean, for the most part, it's pretty clean. You just got a couple little things down there. Right there. But that bubble wrap did work. And you just kind of wipe her down. That's it. Take that little glass off and just wipe it. You know, I ain't trying to spend hours cleaning it. I'm not doing a full on detail, deep clean on it. But, you know, you can't get it wet. See, look at this. Look at everything just moves. That's what you want to see. All right. 
I'll come back to y'all in a second. All right, so I'm all done here with this refrigerator and freezer. Looking pretty decent. Let's get to the rest of the stuff. <laughs> y'all can see it but so much dust on these doors just want to hit these up <coughs> and get up here it's just because from here you can see it so you know when we do house cleaning we just want to get as much stuff you know much dust off as possible like like so And then also, I already did this though, but I just hit up the uh, baseboard. Just like so. But, you know, you could tell they never vacuum around here. This is all dust. So, even over here. So, I'm about to vacuum this room. And then uh, got to go run an errand, and then I'm going to come back and uh, start cleaning the uh, carpet, hopefully. 
you know, I try to do it so I'm right at the tail end of, of their cleaning, so we'll see. But, yeah, but y'all can see this. A couple things just to show you guys what the cleaners are doing. They got, they got some, you know, two bathrooms to clean and the kitchen pretty much, and then they do the, uh, the windows, you know, the, uh, the window coverings just to dust them. We're not doing a, a full on super, super detailed uh, deep clean. We're just doing a, a you know, a clean for them. It is, a, it is like a deep clean, but it's like our, our standard. You know, if they wanted to do a, if they wanted us to do more super detailed, uh, then that's what we'll do. But for instance, typically, like if the wall is 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 clean, you know, you, if you look at this wall, I don't know if you can see it, but you see there's a whole bunch of scuffs, marks, dirt. So usually around here would be dirty, so we would wipe around that, right? But in this case, if we were to wipe around that, you'll be able to see a big difference. So we have to leave it alone. Same thing for like here. So if we're looking. You know, this is so this is so dark, we may just kind of try to blend it in, but if we clean this, we'll have to clean this whole wall. So we don't want to get, you know, super detailed on it. That would be kind of crazy. You know, they uh prepping for the uh the bathrooms and stuff. You can see stuff like that. So, it's just in this type of case, you just got to pick and choose what we're doing, right? Cuz look at this room. You can see how they painted portions of it, tried to get around the uh, light switch. S same thing there. So you just pick and choose. Cause look at this. Man, we'd be cleaning. We'd be cleaning the whole wall if we touch one piece. And then over here, they got some type of water issue going on, so we staying away from there. But y'all can see the, the walls, they're just, it might be kind of hard to see, but they just all just, just nasty, you know? So, it's kind of hard to clean, to get very, very, very detailed with it, because it's just, they need, they need a full, full on detailed, super detailed cleaning, which will cost like four times what we're, we're charging now. The uh, cleaning for this one, uh, we do charge per square foot. Uh, so that's how we'll do it. But if it's a uh, super detailed, like you see, you know, if you look at this wall, Super dirty, a lot of, a lot of uh, just dirt throughout the whole wall. So if they want something like that, yeah, I'm telling you, that's gonna cost. But that's not what they're looking for. So definitely capable of it. It just costs. Anyway, let me get to vacuuming. I'll show you guys a piece of this. Look at this.
All right, Charles. So I've been quiet because I'm focused. I'm just trying to get this stuff done, trying to uh, stay caught up with the cleaners because it's not like watch them. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking about caught up as making sure that we all leave at the same time or we finish at the same time. So that's what I'm, uh, that's what I'm uh, just trying to stay focused on because they killing it on the, on the, on the cleaner, man. And giving away all services. I'm like, come on now. <laughs> That's on them, though. They, they really, uh, they really care about the brand. So they always just try to do their best. Um, she was telling them about, uh, the mold and stuff on the wall. She was like, I just, I'll just wipe it down. I'm like, man, that's extra. That's, that's dangerous. So I'm just trying to explain to them, like, don't be giving away y'all services. We don't be doing that around here. I'm gonna see what's up with this, uh, with this tile and grout. See if they'll, uh, see if they'll go for it. This area in the kitchen. I'm gonna see what, see what they're talking. Cause, cause the uh, the lady that moved out, she's the one that's pretty much paying for for the cleaning, and then he's moving in. So I'm gonna tell him like, hey, that black on there that ain't coming out with just a regular mop, and they better not these cleaners better not try, you know, or scrub extra hard and like that's not how we roll, cause this. Super deep clean, this stuff ain't included. But let's make it happen, let's finish this. Uh, I just got this living room and then the uh, dining room over there to do. So I'll come back to you on a second. So I, I ended up asking the, uh, the guy here, I said, do you want the, uh, the floor deep clean because it's not gonna come out. You know, we could do the tile and grout cleaning. It's just a small kitchen. That's just for the cleaning, right? So I was just like, it's $100, um, and I'll throw in the front area for free, since it's not, you know, it's just a small little area. He <laughs> was like, let me call the, uh, basically the person I spoke with, like the lady I spoke with that was living here. He goes, let me call her and see if she wants to have that. <laughs> so, let's see what he say. Because we're not about to start scrubbing floors and we're not getting paid for it, so. Note to y'all, make sure y'all set the expectations. And I, I really did that because knowing my cleaners, they're gonna wanna do a, an exceptional job. <laughs> and then they're gonna try to uh, get it clean, but that's something I gotta teach them is you know, we're not, we're not getting over on people, but we're just keeping it honest, you know what I'm saying? It's, uh, it, it is an extra, uh, 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 an additional cost, an extra cost to deep clean your floor. You know, we can mop it, but we're not about to sit there and, and, and I'm not about to have them break their backs, you know? Just like I told him with the, uh, hold on. Sorry about that. He said, uh, she said only a regular clean only. So that means only mop it. So that's exactly what I'm trying to explain to uh, my cleaners. Like, you know, we don't, we're not looking for perfection here. We're not looking for, you know, that's why, like in certain areas, you might you might just see me going quicker on the carpet because I'm not going to sit here uh, deep deep cleaning the carpet. And it's, it's I mean this carpet is through, you know. So they just want a you know, regular clean. And it's, a, it's still a deep clean, but it's not you know as deep. So it all comes down to uh, you know what what they want, but I can always get a really good sense of how somebody wants something clean, you know? So. I mean, 
Okay, let's uh, let me start the uh, the steaming and then uh, get on to the last room. Y'all see the difference? The dirt coming out, man. That's definitely what's gonna happen. You can always take out dirt. As I always say, stains are another thing. You know what I'm saying? It's a little harder to remove the stain. Yeah, we try. We'll go over it a few times. I bet you they had a fish tank right here. I bet you the uh, filter on the fish tank was doing that. And then they had it right there. In a second, I'm gonna show you guys where I uh, where I did the sample on the uh, the tile. I just did one tile and just a hair. You know, what I'm saying not like super 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 scrub on the tile uh, on the grout, but I did do some some scrubbing because for one, I already kind of knew they was gonna say no. But, you know, just, um, just to show them, hey, you know, there is dirt in there, but I don't want there to be like a huge clean square of, uh, of tile that's clean, tile and grout. See how that dirt is straight cutting? Tell me y'all. Uh, I can always remove dirt. And now you gotta see like some uh, some, uh, some streaks. Just go back over it. My jets are fine. They're uh, spraying just right. But it happens when I overlap. That's when you'll see the, the line. So I just like to go over it one good time. So y'all can see that. Anyway, let me finish and I'll come back to you on a second. Okay, so you guys see the floor here. So what I did was I just did this one tile. But I kind of, you know, because the, the, the grout is black, man, I just kind of hit it up real quick. So. They didn't want it done, but this is how this floor is going to stay. I mean, they're going to sweep and mop, but other than that, there's no getting the black stuff out. And then they did a nice, good cleaning on there. And there was black. I took some before and afters, even over here. Y'all see them back there. They went super deep in here. All in there was brown at the bottom. These cleaners be killing it. It's looking good. Even the even the uh, crud 
there was like so much buildup around the, the edge um, of the burner that all that came out. So, so now we're about to do this one here. Again, we're not looking for for uh, for perfection. We're just really just looking to uh, clean it up real quick. I did mix some. Uh, I did mix some tile and grout cleaner for this floor because it's just it's through. You know they need to. I'm telling y'all, this has been my 2021. It's just been dirty carpet. I wasn't like this last year. Uh, but let's see what what keeps happening. Keeps, what keeps, yeah, that's right. Anyway, what keeps happening. <laughs> anyway, let's see what what, uh, what goes on for the rest of the year. But, you know, when it's dirty like this, extra got to be charged, you feel me? So, let's do it. All right, y'all, so we done. Look Thank you, you're welcome. Thank you. So, this here is this area here. You can still see the outline. That's just what's going to happen. And then we have this. Got this room. And we have this room. And then show you this. Y'all remember what that looked like? Toilet. Actually, we usually get this down. So, yeah, toilet. Did the blinds, they did. Go inside, outside of the window. Did in here. Came out really good. And I also want to show you guys what the uh, what the cleaners did, man. They just started scrubbing the floor. You know, I turned around and it didn't even. I said, don't scrub the floor. They don't pay for it. So, they was on their hands and knees scrubbing floors, but I wasn't paying attention. So, anyway, we out of here. Forgot to show you guys this room. They did this floor here. Just a mop. So, 